welcome to Morris Money, where we give you stock tips in under five minutes. I'm your host, Morris Willie. Today, we're talking about Eyeless's Middle Eastern market plans, the company opening their Saudi Arabia office, and we're also going to touch on them recently opening their Dubai office. Due to recent events and the corresponding increased oil price, increased demand on defense and associated rescue vehicles, as well as several multi-billion dollar constructive projects in the Middle Eastern region, solutions from within the Eyeless business are in high demand. In addition to its existing factory and offices in Dubai, Eyeless recently opened an office in Dubai which can accommodate up to 75 staff members. Great news to hear for Eyeless as they're opening up new offices, but let's get back to the market demand Eyeless is having within the Middle East. With the rising oil price which is expected to climb to over $140 per barrel, Eyeless is already fielding new requirements from oil and gas customers in the Middle East. Historically, Eyeless acquisitions TVC, Firebug, and BCD Fire have significantly increased their revenue during periods of increased oil prices, and Eyeless is already seeing a repeat in this trend. Having been involved in several companies in the Middle East, Eyeless management has previously experienced the increased capital expenditure in the region that takes place when oil prices increase. The increased oil price leads to increased capital expenditure in this sector, not only in refinery and general infrastructure upgrades, but also in renewed maintenance of firefighting vehicles and equipment. The Middle Eastern markets will inevitably increase production to fill the void left by sanctions on the Russian market. This puts Eyeless in an even stronger position as the company has already seen an increased demand for TVC and firebug vehicles as military and international organizations have been shoring up their defense and rescue vehicle fleets in response to the conflict in Ukraine. Prior to the increased oil price, Saudi Arabia itself was already seeing a massive boost in its non-oil economy. Coupled with the increasing oil price, the country is experiencing an even greater economic boom, fueling its increased demand for solutions from within the Eyeless stable. Eyeless management and senior team members from within its acquisitions hold several strong relationships with senior officials and key decision makers in the region, which has already led to promising contract discussions. Eyeless has previously mentioned its targeting contracts linked to the 500 billion Saudi Arabian NOEM project, from which the first phase is due to be completed in 2025. In further Middle Eastern developments resulting from heightened demand, BCD Fire is currently obtaining regional permits to distribute fire alarm cable in the Middle East and is in the process of finalizing an OEM supply contract with a large global fire alarm cable manufacturer. The company has previously imported more than five shipping containers per month when the strong economy in the region led to increased capital expenditure on infrastructure. BCD Fire has in recent months increased its staff complement to over 60 personnel in order to obtain licensing for the fulfillment of large installments and maintenance contracts. Now, of course, this wouldn't be an Eyeless video without us getting a comment from management. So here is Eyeless Managing Director, John Paul Backwell. He commented, both Nick and myself have been involved in various companies such as Firebug in the Middle East, which previously saw a huge influx of business when the oil price increased and when there were large construction projects related to sports events, smart city developments, and simply the general push by Middle Eastern countries to attract more attention than their neighbors. We are seeing the same thing happen at the moment as the Middle Eastern market invests in upscales. I know we are in the best position than we have ever been to capitalize on the increased capex in the region. For example, we are already seeing the requirements to build new rescue vehicles for oil and gas customers to armor plate ambulances and humanitarian aid vehicles to supply rapid response firefighting vehicles for a chain of hotels to build rescue drone prototypes for testing in the UAE to import and supply container loads of fire alarm cable and equipment and even design customized health and safety training for a group of 32 independent schools in the Middle East. It's this and more which drives the urgency of our new facility requirements in Saudi Arabia following on from our new offices in Dubai. 
In the same way that we are laying a strong foundation in the U.S. with both manufacturing and distribution capability being acquired in with more on the way, we are also gearing up for an extensive growth in the Middle East, where we are already well positioned to execute. We look forward to updating shareholders on our significant new deals in the Middle East soon, as well as updating on our new offices and much more exciting news as it happens in the coming weeks. This video was over five minutes long, but let me know what you think on Alice below because this was a lot of news we had to cover and exciting news at that. Please don't take this video as financial advice and thank you for watching Morris Money.